there are some simple, very easy ways that people talk about which the Gurus has said that these are the characteristics of the Gursik. The characteristic of the Gursik is one who is never using harsh words. The characteristic of a Gursik is one who doesn't have attachment to sleep, doesn't have attachment to tastes or food. So these are the kind of qualities that Gurbani has said time and time again, and there are lots more, where the Gurbani has talked about this is how you recognize what a person is like when they're on this spiritual path, when they've achieved some sort of spiritual greatness, is that they lose their attachments to all of these things. Guru Gobind Singh Ji says exactly the same things when he talks about the Khalsa. And the Khalsa is one who has destroyed the five evils, the five vices within them. The Khalsa is one who sees everyone as equal. So these are the kind of qualities that we see throughout Gurbani where, where Guru actually shows us what it feels like. But that's not goals for you to achieve. Yes, you can check whether you're actually doing those things and chances are you can use them to say, I need to be better at this or I need to be better at that. But if you're seeing this as spiritual progression, if you're seeing this as I have achieved and I am getting better, then what you're saying is I'm now starting to become higher than some other people because they're not doing it. And that's where ego really kicks in and that's where you have to be really careful. Because ego at any point will kick in and say, I'm better than everyone else now. And so that's what you need to realize. So this has to become a journey of losing the I and gaining you, where you don't see yourself as I, you see it as you. And along the way there will be some milestones and you'll be able to point them out. And if you read Gurbani, you'll be able to see what some of those milestones are. Do you have lustful thoughts towards others? Do you have anger towards others? Or have you now started to leave these things? Gurbani says that the, the Panchvikar, the five thieves, they've run away from me. They're now my slave. Gurbani talks about death can no longer touch me. So these are the milestones that are there. But you don't have to aim for those milestones. These are the milestones that come when you start losing yourself. So the only yardstick that you have to measure yourself at is, am I still here? If I'm still here, then you still need to work a little bit more. If all that there is is you, then you will see all the qualities start running after you. But they're not the qualities. We don't run after the qualities. We run after the end goal and all the qualities will start running after us.